How do I say this again? Brick Maniacs is welcome back and we are, wait, you messed me up, Jeff. Brick Maniacs, welcome back to another sit rep episode of Brick Mania TV. Welcome. Welcome. All right, Dan, uh, what do we got going Let's on here? Let's just launch right into it. Yeah. Uh, new releases. Let's new releases. Let's talk about some new releases. This is new releases this right week. There. Actually, kind of a small week on new releases, but you'll be pleasantly surprised by the cool restocks, which we'll get to later. So, new French, uh, this is the... What is this? <laughs> yeah. M1917 Grand Puissance Filo. Filo. Yeah, it's French. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. That was I, I, really good. Yeah, was no, it was great, terrible. Great it's one, 155 millimeter howitzer. Um, French. This is a really, it's a long yeah. rifle. We did a whole sit rep on this. Uh, check, check it, it out. out. Yes, and I butchered the title. Actually, I didn't even bother trying to pronounce it. I, I knew I was going to butcher it. So, other new releases this week. Um, we have the. What is he called? Starship. Uh, navigator. Ooh, he's so, the navigator, and it comes yes. with a fancy clamshell. Yes, you'll have to have your own mock Russian accent to go along with this guy. Is it Russian? Yeah, yeah. The navigator's always Russian, but he has a triple, triple. Get this triple overmolded <laughs> photon pistol. Photon pistol. V two. Yes. That thing is unbelievable. Yes, uh, yes. Will will unbelievable. He took out all the stops, and yeah, he made it really, really, really awesome. Really awesome. Yes. What else is over there? Oh, we have a new. American. This is American World War One soldier. This is sort of a fancy limited edition guy. He's printed three, you know, 360 to printing. He's printed all the way around. So we have a limited amount of these guys. As you will see, we're going to be restocking that M1897 in the near future. That actually has the old Americans, it's much more plain uniform. So if you really want the fancy this guy, the upgrade. You, you have you have a limited window to get this guy now. Yes. Um, so. Get them while you can. While you can. And this one, Chesty. Chesty Chessy. Polar, the most decorated Marine in US right. history. This, this was our, one of our Black Friday releases, and he is uh, available for a limited time. We have a few left. Um, we made extras. We didn't, we didn't want them to just be available uh, Black Friday. Right. We did put out that Corsair. Of course, that disappeared immediately. Um, but we have Chesty we Puller have Chesty. left. We're actually able to make a little bit more of him. So with uh, accurate uniform, and I tried to get a good representation of uh, what the guy looks like. So this is a Korean War era, right? Yes, Korean so War we era. Have, we have Korean War Chosin Bricks will be next month's hashtag. Don't start using it till next month. But uh, you'll be pleasantly surprised by the cool stuff we have up our oh, sleeve yeah. for next month. So right now the hashtag is still Great War Great Bricks. War Bricks, yes. In, in, in honor of the uh, ending, the 99th anniversary of the end of, of World War I. There we go. Yeah. There we go. 99 years ago this month. All right. All right, so we'll put the new releases away. Should we do? Should we announce next? So we're just no, talking about hashtags. Wait, wait, wait. No, let's, not, let's okay, talk about okay. the, the prizes for next time. Prizes for next time. Prizes. Yeah, we can do the, that. The next prizes. So, sort of on a theme we're going on, we have sci fi theme giveaway prizes. So this is the prize you have for the, the next week's Sit Rep Report. Stay tuned for later in this episode. Yes, so these are the prizes we'll we announce have. announce the winner. We have the Constellation Class Cruiser, the Starship Captain, and his Captain's Chair too. Ooh. Can't forget that. And a Brick Arm Sci-Fi Pack, which has a lots and lots of cool guns. If you don't have a, a Sci-Fi uh, collection starter, this is a good way, a good this time to a get a started. way to start. And uh, that's some cool, there's some cool stuff in there that you can't even get unless you get this. In the pack. back of it. Yeah, the back shows it also here. Let's zoom awesome. in on that. Ooh. So I like that silver gun. It's like a pump action laser gun or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't know what it's called. Pump action laser gun. I don't yeah, yeah. But that thing. That's cool. <laughs> oh anyway. Let's move on, move on. So that's hashtag Great War Bricks on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter for your chance to win. We will randomly select somebody, as we will today. We do this every every yes. every Monday at the sit rep. We announce the winner. Uh, we'll also announce them online in case you, uh, in other in other places in case you miss. So yeah, take a cool picture of one of your own creations, a minifigure, anything. Yep. Just tag it with that. Yep. Right. Yep. That's all you have to do to qualify. Okay. It's easy, easy. Super easy. There's no reason to not to do it. Okay. Yep. Restocks, right? Restocks. We got a lot, a lot of restocks. restocks. We, they've been kind of coming in. The, the, our, our, our production crew has been working tirelessly to get stuff done. Uh, there's a lot more coming out. We're just going to review what is available right now that's come out last week. Here's a, uh, a, a three different crates, right? Three different crates, and they're so we have the mystery hurry crate. because they're going fast. Pacific GI Footlocker crate in the Pacific Japanese. So the mystery crate, that is the Wonder Waff. It's not really a mystery because up. we tell you exactly Arr. what comes inside of it. You get the really, really super awesome and super uh, exclusive 
um, yes. Wonder Waffle weapon. So this is like a quadruple over molded thing. It's and then you know, Will has to hand make these. These are crazy. You have yes. the zombie Nazi head. And then what is this called? Like dilithium or something? I don't know what it's called. <laughs> yeah, you have it, Yeah, you have some more vials of, of the the stuff that makes the Wonder Waffle work. Um, being not a video game person myself, I don't know what it's called, but I'm sure somebody will write it into the, the comments. Yes. I think these pop out here. I wouldn't take them out. You're gonna lose them. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're double. They're over molded okay, ammunition okay, okay. capsules. These pop out. They do. Yeah, but I, I just Molded. leave them where they are because you're gonna lose them, and we don't have more. So if you lose one. You're done. Yeah, you're done. You're fired. All right, that's going back in here. Right, and Pacific crates. The both Pacific crates are back. Should we go over them real quick? Sure, sure. Let's All right, you them. open that one up. All right. I'll open this one up. Let's not mix Doing the, stuff. Let's not mix the two. Arr! Voiding the warranty. Yes. All right. Woo. I win. You do win. Ziploc bag. Ziploc bag. It's full of goodies. Goodies, goodies, goodies. Isn't this fun watching us take stuff out of... Oh, it's like an unboxing video. It is. It's even better. All right, so we have Clutchy Stud brand... Cigarettes. <laughs> Can we say cigarettes? No, you can't. No, Clutchy we, Stud brand candy. We've just voided our, our, our YouTube warranty. <laughs> Clutchy Stud brand candy. And then some rations, a captured, uh, is that the Nambu pistol? Ooh, it is a Nambu pistol. Ooh, and, and those are rare. You yes. have, the only way you can get the Nambu is in the, can you get it in the Japanese packers? It's still I don't just, remember. I don't remember. Yeah, I There's think you might, this might be one of the Captured things. sword oh, and yeah. a captured flag. And look, it even has my personal <laughs> Captain Daniel A. Siskin crate. <laughs> Which, they made that while I was out of town. I had, I had no, uh, I had no say. What is this? <laughs> I came back and it was done, so. All right, what do you have in yours? I have the Pacific crate. This is, this is the, uh, I think these are backwards. Pacific, no, no, no okay, good, Foot Locker crate. Yeah, you're right, right. This, is, this must be the Japanese Foot Locker. Yep, yeah. Pacific Japanese Foot Locker. So you have your Japanese equivalent of the, of the Foot Locker. Do you remember what's on these? There's some sort of ration. One says, one says rice, and the other says like peanuts or something. It's some okay. sort of like ration. Oh, butter. okay, okay. It's like sesame. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that sounds peanut. good. You have a sake bottle. What kind of taste? And I'm not sure what that is either. Is that a coin? Tuna. That's tuna. Oh, cool. Canned tuna. And you get the cool radio. <laughs> I love the radio. This is one of my favorite the uh, favorite pieces. Here. Yeah. So that's modeled after an actual uh, Japanese radio. And yeah. That's it was cool. a, a super compact. Oh, it's printed on the side. Too. Yeah. Side printing. Filled radio. And then you have. You have the helmet, Japanese, this is the Type 99, I don't remember the number is. Type, type, type something. Yeah, yeah, it's Japanese, the classic Japanese World War II helmet with the star printing on it, which Ooh, is really cool because... Textured uh, star printing. Yeah, pretty much every one of these helmets came with this, you know, from the factory, it, the Toyota factory or wherever they were making the Honda, right. Honda plant with, with the star on them. Because, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it was imperial that way. All right. Yeah, so, so, was, so those are the new crates. They're going fast, of course. Uh, because they're super popular and we can't keep up with them in. Cannot keep yeah. up. So next up for the restocks is the uh, 75 millimeter MLE 1897 yeah. World War II French World War One French cannon. Yes. Yeah, so this is the famous French 75. You get two French uh, riflemen in there. These yes. are these are the old school Just guys. Some, yeah, our first generation yeah. Frenchmen. Yeah, our first generation French. With one difference is we actually have the right head gear. Yes. Design. We originally just put kepis in there because that's Adrian all we can helmet. Get. So we put the Adrian helmets in there. They have uh, label rifles, do they not? Yeah. They do. They, they have do. the label rifles with bayonet. These are handmade, handmade brick arms pieces. So good way to get these. Uh, and this is a nice price for this. So nice, yeah. nice. Okay. Two more. On to the two big more. Yeah. Which one first? Which one? Doesn't matter. Let's okay. One. Stuka. Stuka. Yeah, the Ju87. This is. World War II terror weapon used by the, the, the Nazi regime to, you know, ground, basically ground assault uh, from the air. Yes. We have a review video on this one, correct? Oh, yeah, yeah. This yeah. came out, this is the restock. So this this came out like last year sometime. Awesome. And then oh, yeah. May, or this year, earlier this year, May. Okay, Time's cool. going by really fast. All right, check out the uh, link in the description for a review video on this one. Yep. And then also the Mark V, Five. this is the big World War I. Uh, this is the Mark V male version, so mm -hmm. it has two big uh, 57 millimeter um, guns on it. Yep. And so this is available for a limited time. This is probably one of the most popular World War One kits we've done. Right. Um, it's one of the the high end of the World War One kits. Uh, of course, you can also still get some battle packs. I believe the battle packs, uh, World War One battle packs, there's a few left of those. Cool. So and then, you know. A, a couple of weeks ago, we had zero World War One kits. We are fully stocked. Yes. Great War books are also in stock. Um, get them while you can, because uh, 
Again, we're having a hard awesome. time keeping up. We make everything in house, guys. I don't know if people realize that we don't just like push a button and like stuff comes from Amazon, and then we sell it to you. We actually have to make this stuff yes. put together. Awesome. So it's, it's link, a lot of work. There's a link in the description for the review video on this. Check that out. Sure. And so one more, spe a couple of specials actually. So today only. This is the last day. Last of, day. Last day of the, uh, the so I guess Cyber Cyber Weekend. Black Friday, Cyber Monday. If you order fifty dollars or more through the website, you will get one of these fancy Brick Mania twenty eighteen calendars. People have, been, and people have been asking us for calendars forever. So right, right. So we're we're Chalk delivering now. Cool photos. And again, we printed this in house. Did we? Yeah. That? Yes. And then we had to hand punch all the, the holes in it. It was great because because <laughs> we love you guys. So we're making calendars for you. If you don't get one, and the, during the sale, here's a picture of all Ooh. the cool. If you don't get one during the, the, the freebie giveaway, you can still buy one. We'll, whatever's left, we'll have on the website. Um, it's probably not going to be much at the rate that these are going, but uh, you have a limited time today only. Get it for free. Orders of $50 or more. And also, still doing the free shipping. Uh, yeah. Continuing the free shipping offer. It's been such a popular thing that we're just going to keep it going for a little while longer. $50 in the U.S., $100 worldwide. Uh, I believe if you order now, you don't really have a problem uh, uh, with, with getting it before the holidays, mm -hmm. but don't delay. Uh, otherwise, you're gonna be paying extra for faster delivery. Yeah, we don't wanna do that. All right, I think some people are anxiously waiting for the announcement, right? Right. Of the winner. So if you just skipped ahead and are now joining us, we're gonna be doing the hashtag giveaway. Hashtag <laughs> Great, Great War, War Bricks. Bricks. Did he have a picture that he included with this thing? So he posted up a picture. Um, it's Tom, Tom, Tom Lyle from Tom. Facebook. We will be posting a picture. What does he win? Okay. Awesomeness. Awesomeness. So both of our crates, the Allies and the and the uh, Central Powers crates, which you, by the way, have already sold out. We put these oh. out at the beginning of the month. So this is nice. So Tom, you are getting a, a pack that's yeah, going to make everyone else jealous. <laughs> who's watching this. Uh, so two crates and the Great War instructional book. Right. Look how thick that thing is. Right. This this is this is basically the, the earlier Brick Mania World War One kits. The ones that are worthy. So I mean, the really old ones we've. We're not putting those in there. <laughs> our, our standards are much much higher than yes. back in the old days. So this so. is the modern standard right here. Right. right. This is this is all stuff from last year uh, and earlier this year. Awesome. All right. That's the sit rep. That is a sit rep. For more information, check out brickmania.com. Check out the links in the description for everything you've seen here in the video. And there's a crazy amount of new releases, restocks and stuff all in the pipeline. Just keep checking back the website every day. If you don't see it, now we might have it uh, in the next week or so. Cool. All right. Thank you very much for watching.